So EA re-released the Max 87 Icon upgrade. Let's open a bunch of these packs and hopefully get some decent icons. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast and reliable Ultimate Team coins, check out MMOEXP.com. Link in the description, save 5% using code HABER. I've got a little graphic here showing you guys all 27 icons available. You got yourself Balak, John Barnes, Cliver, Lampard, Makalele, Petit, Pires, Rykard, Rush, yada yada yada. We've got Torres in there, Vidic. Uh, Xabi Alonso, Essien, Zambrotta, uh, Hernandez, Zola. Some really good icons there, to be fair. And then obviously some absolute stinkers. So, realistically, EA, if I can avoid, if I can avoid Gattuso, Vidic, and Blanc, that would be oh, but Blanc's not in it, but Vidic and Gattuso, that'd be ideal. I did just do the Vidic SBC. Dutch, Cam, Clarence, Seydorf. Mm. I think it could have been worse. I don't think I'll use this card, but I think it could have been a lot worse. It's not great, though. It's not a great start for the uh, for the year table video, is it? At least he's not discarded. He's over 100k. So I'm not going to complain too much about that. And we're going to move on. All right, we go again. We shake it off and we go again. Come on. Show us a better icon this time. It's going to be Croatia Striker. Davos Suk is not bad, if you ask me. This is a very usable card. It's going to get stick. People are going to say it's rubbish, whatever. I think that's a decent card. Uh, if you've ever used him in game, you'll understand why he's a decent card as well. But it's not one of the super fancy ones. I think he's all right, though. He's sadly only 70k, which is a bit of a disappointment. I think that one's discard. So, yeah, not an exciting one again. EA also dropped a supreme season opener pack, which is 40 rare golds, 185 or higher. It's not worth this. Do not, do not buy FC points to buy this. It's definitely not worth it. That is a terrible value for money. But I am going to open it for content anyway. We do get a double walkout in mine. It is Modric and Kevin... Not Kevin De Bruyne. What? I mean, it's Frankie De Jong. That looks so much like Kevin De Bruyne. That looks so much like Kevin De Bruyne. We've got ourselves uh, Trent in there as well. I mean, it's not the worst pack in the world, to be fair. But it wasn't worth 2,500 FC points. All right, we go again. Next 87 icon pack for Dan the Gooner. Here we go. Come on. French. CDM, Petit. This is a dub regardless. Petit or Makalele, and it's a W. Regardless, it is Petit. That's a very good one. And Luton have just scored against uh, Liverpool. Wow, W's all round. Petit solid. Petit didn't play for Arsenal, did he? I don't know why. For some reason, I always have this idea that Petit played for Arsenal. It's because he did play for Arsenal. There you go. Arsenal past and present player. And he's a really good one as well because he's like 380k. Our first big win of the video. Let's go, man. All right, we've got Dario's second account now. He's a max 87 pack on his second account. Come on. Good nation again, please, EA. It's Argentina striker. It is Crespo. Again, it's not terrible. This is the thing. It's not a terrible card, actually. Like, that's not a bad card. The stats are pretty decent and, and he'll probably score a lot of goals in game. He's just not a sexy icon, is he? Like he's not a he's not a Torres or an Essien or a or a Petit or someone worth a lot of coins that people are gonna overlook this card. But that is a really good icon in game. For this stage of the game, he will do a great job, in my opinion. Alright, we've got Mr. Pricey's icon next. Here we go. Who are we getting in this one? Spain is the is the nation that you want the most. French is probably second though. I think Perez is pretty decent. My friend Ewan got Perez uh last week in his icon pack, and he said he's pretty decent. So I think he's, a, he's an okay card. Again, he's one of those that, like, at this stage of the game is good. The only problem with Perez is that, well, I'd say there's two problems. First of all, is that you could probably get a card for cheaper than the Icon SBC that's better than this card. But second of all, this card is probably going to be outdated in the next month anyway. And if you've already done SBCs, like, Odegaard probably gets in over Perez and things like that. You know what I mean? So that's the, that's the downside with this card. But if you can fit him in, it's an, it's an okay card. All right, Waz's pack. Let's see what Waz is getting. Is Wazza getting a W icon? He's got Vidic. Now, if he's not done the Vidic SBC, this is good. If he's not already done the SBC, this is solid because Vidic is decent in game. If he's already done the Vidic SBC, though, that is a really, really annoying icon to get. So he is worth like 250k, which is a W. Has he done the Vidic SBC? Let's quickly check his SBCs and see if Vidic is still there. Because if Vidic is still there, we are happy, unless he's obviously completed like a good chunk of it. Icons. Okay, good. He's not even started it. So that is a W. We'll take that. All right, we've got a standard icon pack. Who is it going to be? It's going to be English. Left VA. I think that might be John Barnes. Or Ashley Cole. John Barnes? That's good. He's one of the more expensive ones, actually. That's a decent card, by the way. 
a card that often gets overlooked in FIFA, but at this stage of the game, class. And I know, by the way, I, I know I know the card is going to get on my back, all right? Oh my God, you're saying every icon's good, whatever, because ultimately, if I open someone's icon and we get a bad icon, I don't want to just sit there and tell them their icon's terrible, do you know what I mean? I feel bad, but that is actually a good one. That is genuinely a good one. And he could play left wing or cam, so solid. And he's like 370k. All right, we need to avoid Vidic with this one, EA, because he's already got base Vidic. I didn't see anyone else in his team that was an icon um, that you can get in this. So it's going to be another Crespo, which to be honest gets in his team, I think. He had, I think, Ansu Fati's Evo up top. And this card will be better at scoring goals than Ansu Fati, in my opinion. He will do the business. So I think he's all right. All right, we've got Dario's main account now. Let's see what we can get for Dario on his main account. His second account was, I think, Crespo, if I remember correctly. So hopefully the main is better. Come on. Come on. Sweden. The only the only positive is Dario's a main United fan. He's a past the present main United player. That's the only positive. That is a bad one. That is a really bad one. That is a really, really bad one, isn't it? What is he even worth? Like less than 70k, 60k. Oh, ho, ho. that is the worst one today so far. What's this? Wait, what did I just get? Is that just a normal Centurion? Yeah. Who is it? Who have we just packed? Who's that? Kiesa! Go on! Okay. That is a... That's... Wow, okay. Uh, I really just was not expecting that at all. He's 250k! Hoo <laughs> Guess in there. That was from a 50 champs wins 100k pack. <laughs> Kimmich as well. Oh, yeah. That is fantastic. What a card, by the way. I might have to change my team up and get him in, to be honest. Oh, he's opened it. It was a centre mid. All I saw was centre mid. Who is it? Oh, Balak. Nice. That is one of the best. I think he's like top four for value. Top five for value. I don't really know. But that is a class card. Almost Hullet Club as an 87 rated icon as well. I don't know exactly his value, but I want to say it's like three. Footbin, help me out. How much is he? Footbin, how much is he? He is 350 exactly. So absolutely fantastic. And he gets straight in the team. Look at that. Straight in the team. We love that. Normal icon spiller max 87 SML. I, I feel like. I should be able to speak another language now with the share plays over the last like three or four years, but can't. Just can't. Here we go. Who's it going to be? Germany again. Yes. All right. Another Balak. <laughs> Happy with Balak, to be fair. He's a really, really good icon to get. Another 350k icon. Very nice. Although I will say, I don't know if I can do another max 87 rated spin. Like, I hope the next icon packs we get don't have a rating minimum because I would love to get an opportunity to pack like Mia Ham or something like that. But he's also doing the 3,000 FIFA, 3,000 FC points Centurion pack. This could be huge. I wonder when we get comp for these as well. And if everyone gets compensation or if it's just the people that only got one or two walkouts. We'll see. Who is he going to get in his pack? So it's going to be Germany again. Kimmich? Nice. So Kimmich is the first player. Higher than 88 walkout next to him. Ruben Dusch. Ruben Dusch. All right. Maybe there's some Dangler Centurions or something there as well. Potentially. It's just the people that didn't get the walkouts. They tweeted it. Oh, that's a shame. Well, at least some people are getting compensation. Neuer! Oh, my word. See, this is why I feel like everyone should get compensation. I got three walkouts in my whole pack. And I've seen literal full pages of walkouts since they, like, fixed the packs. Which is why I just think they were booked. And Kyle Walker! What a pack. That's incredible. That is a sick pack, man. All right, we've got a scam pack for Lala now. Let's see what he gets. We've had some pretty good pack look in this video as well. We had the Chiesa earlier and stuff like that. We've actually had a pretty decent day for pack look. Who is going to be an 84 or an 85? Sorry. No walkout. Wow. you got to say what a pack that is. All right, next icon pack is going to be Sweden again. It's going to be Shrek. Oh. Right, I'm going to say it right now. We need Zlatan Ibrahimovic and we need 
Gareth Bale icon cards to stop the Welsh and Swedish flags from being massive letdowns. All right, we're going to end off today's video with one more scam pack. Let's see if we can get something good for Don Spring. It's going to be Spanish center back Irene. All right, Paredes, double walkout. It is a double walkout. Let's go. Who is going to be the dangler walkout? Go and be someone really good. Be Mbappe. You know you want to. Bruno, Bruno, Bruno. Gets a sponsor like Cristiano. Sorry. Um, Looks good in the away kit, doesn't he? Get in there. The rest of it's pretty meh. Unless it's a decent, like, duplicate dangler. Odegaard and Maggle. Four walkouts is okay. Four walkouts is not the end of the world. If you guys have enjoyed, though, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new around here. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you later.